Hey folks, so a lot of you on YouTube have been making and playing something called Paper Games, but my channel's about paper computer games. I wanted to explain what the difference between them is. So, near as I can tell, uh, Paper Games were created by this guy, IPGS. He wanted to make his own video games, but he couldn't, so he resorted to paper. There's a lot of variation among the games made by a lot of different people, but generally they work like this. They emulate console games, and sometimes handhelds. They're played by just one person. That person plays with a paper controller. He presses a button on the controller, and that makes something happen on the paper screen. There's even a paper console you put car paper cartridges in, which doesn't actually do anything for the game, but which is nonetheless considered an essential tradition. I must admit, it is pretty darn cool. And that's how the player goes on an adventure. He follows the on-screen instructions, makes choices, and overcomes obstacles. Many of these games are adaptations of real video games, or at least loosely based on them, but some have original stories of their own. They really are like console games, but on paper. They even have menu screens, file select, and so on. Paper computer games, on the other hand, are more abstract. Paper computer games, or PCGs, were created by this guy, Chris. He wanted to make his own computer games, but couldn't, so he resorted to paper. PCGs are based on computer games, especially old point-and-clicks. So instead of making paper controls, in a PCG, you just say what you're going to do. Like you'll say, I'll pick up the wrench, or I'll put the wrench on the button. Because of this, the games require two players, unlike paper games. One person is the player, who's the one trying to solve the puzzles, and the other one, usually the one who made the game, is there to tell you if it works or not, or what happens. So basically, you explore the paper screen by asking questions about it, like, what's that, or how tall is the wall, if you can't tell by the drawing. And then there's puzzles, and you solve them and move on to the next screen and the next. That's how you have an adventure. Most of these games have original stories, and they're part of a larger comic book style universe with crossovers. So that's basically the difference. Paper, com paper games are like the paper version of console video games, while paper computer games are more like the paper version of computer point and click games. In fact, I almost think paper games should be called paper video games, and then the term paper games would be like an umbrella term that includes both PCGs and paper video games. But really, it's not my place to decide what paper games should be called. I'm sort of an outsider of the community. But either way, these are both noble traditions that have survived for quite a few years now. They've both inspired a lot of different people to make some really cool games. I hope both series continue to survive and thrive. They both have their unique advantages and disadvantages and th cool things you can do with them. And really, the series can exist side by side, and I'm hoping there will be more crossover between them in the future. Uh, PCGs have mostly been made by my own circle of friends so far, but I'd like to see it expand further. I'd really like to see what you guys would do with the concept. All you paper gamers out there should try making a PCG yourself, play it with your friends on YouTube. That would be pretty darn cool. And who knows, maybe I'll try making a paper console myself and see what happens. What do you guys think? Should I try my hand at paper games? Let me know in the comments, and for now, thanks for watching, folks!